What is up, 40 fam, and welcome back to the channel, guys. Hey, back with the Netherlands. This time it's Holland versus the Netherlands. I know for me, I I really thought I was y'all y'all had to put me on game that hey, it's more than just Holland, Amsterdam, and the Netherlands and stuff like that. But y'all had to put me on game on a lot. But this is Holland versus the Netherlands. I honestly thought Holland was like a part of the Netherlands. I don't know. But we finna find out. We finna see. Uh, yeah, let's jump into it. Y'all know what? Hit that subscribe button. Keep the recommendations coming. Hey, hit the comments. Because maybe I'd I be saying stuff wrong sometimes. You know what I'm saying? Welcome to the great let's nation see. of Holland. Where the tulips grow, the windmills turn, the breakfast is chocolatey, the people industrious, and the sea tries to drown it all. Except this country isn't Holland. It's time for the difference between Holland, the Netherlands, and a whole lot more. The correct name for this tulip growing, windmill building, haggoslag wow, eating, container ship moving, blues. ocean conquering nation is the Netherlands. But confusion is understandable. The general region has been renamed a lot over a thousand years. In okay, I just confused myself now. So Holland is in the Netherlands, or is the Netherlands? I confuse myself a little. I confuse but confusion myself. is understandable. The general region has been renamed a lot over a thousand years, including as the Dutch Republic, the United States of Belgium, and the Kingdom of Holland. But it's not just history that makes this country's name confusing, because the Netherlands is divided into 12 provinces. Groningen, Trenta, Overhessel, Helderland, Limburg, Noord, Brabant, Zeeland, which, by the way, is the Zeeland that makes this Zeeland new, Friesland, with the oh, little yeah. hearts on its flags, Flevoland, Utrecht, yeah. and here's the confusion, Utrecht. Noord, North Holland, and Zuid South. Holland. These provinces make calling the Netherlands Holland like calling the United States Dakota. Though unlike the Dakotas, <laughs> which are mostly empty save for the occasional jackalope, the two Hollands are the most populated mm. provinces and have some of the biggest attractions like Amsterdam and Kokenhof. Chances are, if it's Dutch and you've heard of it, it's in one of the Hollands. Even the government's travel website for the country is Holland.com, okay. officially because it sounds friendlier, but unofficially, it's probably what people are actually searching for. Confusion <laughs> continues because people who live in the Hollands are called Hollanders, but all citizens of the Netherlands are called Dutch, as is their language. But in Dutch, they say, Nederlands, sprekende Nederlanders in Nederland, which sounds like they'd rather we call them Netherlanders, speaking Netherlandish. Meanwhile, next door oh, in dang. Germany, they're Deutsche Sprechen Deutsch in Deutschland, which sounds like they'd rather be called Dutch. This linguistic confusion is why Americans call the pen. Yeah, that confused me a lot right Deutschland, there. Which sounds like they'd rather be called Dutch. This linguistic confusion is why Americans call the Pennsylvania Dutch Dutch, even though they're Germans. To review, this country is the Netherlands, its people are Dutch, and they speak Dutch. There is no country called Holland, but there are provinces of North and South Holland. Okay, so... North and South Holland or provinces. I thought, I ain't gonna lie, I did think at first, at first, at first, I did think it was its own country. But no, I thought, no, I knew it was Holland in there, but I didn't know it was North and South. Maybe I didn't pay attention closely to the other ones, to the other videos that I watched. But hey, you can get the understanding now. Anyway, Got it? You know? Great, because it's about to get more complicated. The Netherlands is part of a kingdom with the same name, the Kingdom of the Netherlands, which is headed by the Dutch royal family. The Kingdom of the Netherlands contains three more countries, and to find them, we must sail from the icy North Sea to the Caribbean oh. and Aruba, Curaçao, and St. Martin. These are no territories, Aruba. but self governing countries Aruba. within the Kingdom of the Netherlands, and as such, they have their own governments and their own currencies. Geography geek oh. side note here while Aruba and Curaçao are <laughs> islands, St. Martin is just the southern half of a tiny island, also named St. Martin, the other half of which is occupied by France, and also named St. Martin. So despite being separated by Belgium <laughs> on the European map, the Kingdom of the Netherlands and the French Republic share a border on the other side of the world on an island so nice they named it thrice. But why does the Kingdom of the Netherlands thrice. reach to the Caribbean anyway? Because empire. In the 1600s, the Dutch, always looking to expand business, laid their hands on every valuable port they could. For a time, America's east coast was New Netherland with its capital city of New Amsterdam. Oh. There was New Zealand, as mentioned previously, and nearby, the king of the islands, New Holland. Though the empire is gone, these three Caribbean nations remain. And while four countries in one kingdom isn't unheard of, it doesn't stop there because the country of the Netherlands also extends its borders to the Caribbean and three more islands, Bonaire, St. Eustatius, and Seba. These are not countries in a kingdom, but are... Dang. Yeah, I ain't gonna lie. If it was my first video, this would be this would be a hard video to just just go off of. If it was the first video, if I was trying to learn something about Holland or the Netherlands, 
This would be tough. I'm glad I know a little. I know a little bit. I know a little bit. Three more islands. This would be tough to kind of go off. These are not countries in a kingdom, but are cities in the country of the Netherlands, and they look the part. Residents of these far-flung cities vote in elections for the Dutch government, just as any Hollander would. Though weirdly, they don't belong to any province, and they don't use the Dutch currency of euros. They use dollars instead. It's kind of like if Hawaii wasn't a state, but technically part of the District of Columbia, all the while using yen. These cities of the country. Country of the Netherlands and these countries in the Kingdom of the Netherlands are together known as the Dutch Caribbean, and their citizens are mm. Dutch citizens. Which, because the Kingdom of the Netherlands is a member of the European Union, means that these Dutch Caribbeans are Dang. also Europeans. So in the end, there are six Caribbean islands: four countries, twelve provinces, two Hollands, two Netherlands, and one kingdom. All Dutch. Bro, that was confusing. Like he did make it more complicated. I ain't gonna lie. It's a little understanding, but he lost me when he was just naming all those Caribbeans and all that. Yeah, yeah. But that's all. I'm going to have to watch that again. Probably not do a video, but I'm going to have to watch that again and really see the breakdown. Because I'm looking like he lost me for a minute. He lost me. Maybe because it was fat. Hey, you know, we all different learners around here. I, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a hands-on type of learner. You know what I'm saying? But, guys, that's all I have for this video. Y'all make sure... Send out more recommendations. Hit that subscribe button. Hey, and y'all be blessed. Be the best and be you. I'm out.